Today's second poem is by Amy Nezuku Matato. It's titled, Dear Amy Nezuka Matuto, a found poem composed entirely of emails from various high school students. If I were to ask you a question about your book and sum it up into one word, it would be, why? I think I like Walt Whitman better than you. I just don't get literature. But for a fast hour and a half read, your book takes the cake. I like how you organize the lines in that one poem to represent a growing, twisting bonsai tree. Are you going to get a rude reaction when you meet that one guy in that one poem? I guess you never know. You are very young to be a poet. I also like how your poems take up an entire page. It makes our reading assignment go faster. In class, we spend so much time dissecting your poems and then deeply analyzing them. I think I like Walt Whitman better than you, but don't take offense. You are very good too. You are young, you are young and pure and really just want to have a good time. Thank you, we have taken a debate and you are a far better poet than Walt Whitman. And I loved how your poems were easy to read and understand. Hello, my name is Alicia. We read your book and I just loved it. We also read Walt Whitman's Leaves of Grass. There was no competition there. I like your book a whole lot better. It was an easy read, but poetry is not my favorite type of literature. Sometimes I am offered drinks and guys try to talk to me, but I too just brush it off and keep dancing. Every once in a while, the creepy mean guys try to offer you things and then they say something. What would you do? Lastly, I was wondering if you ever wrote a poem that really didn't have a deeper meaning, but everyone still tried to give it one anyways. Walt Whitman is better than you.